Hi guys, you know I am an AWS fanboy and one particular product I liked a lot is the CloudWatch. Here you can sort of collate your logs and furthermore do your metrics. So if you look here, you can, you can actually draw a graph and analyze your stuff, which is great. But what's not so good is that it's difficult to share this, this graph with your colleagues. Um, the way I've worked around it in the past, and I'll include the videos, is using Grafana. But now there's this new thing I discovered via YouTube <laughs> um, called Get Widget Image or something like this. So my parents' connection is with Andrews and Arnold in the UK, and they actually supply an API so that I can work out at what rate the FTTC modem is syncing at. And I use the API now to get the download and upload sync speeds. I've been doing this for quite a while. But now I can I can uh, I added the ability to log it and furthermore uh, output a PNG which I embed here. So now I'm keeping track of the download speed, which has gone up. But as you can see, the upload speed for my parents in Cornwall is pretty woeful. I'm tracking this because their copper line that goes to their home, have a look at this video below, um, it actually deteriorates over time. Like in 2016, BT OpenReach sort of fixed it and, and the upload speed synced up at a higher rate. And yay, FaceTime works reliably. But, but over a couple of years, the the copper unfortunately deteriorates and now FaceTime is a bit of a chore, uh, i.e. doesn't work most of the time. So, oh, sorry, I got a bit distracted there, but do please have a look at the source code. Um, I wrote it in Golang. So I try to, this is the function gets the stuff from Andrews and Arnold. Um, this is the function that logs to CloudWatch. I did notice that when you log and then retrieve an, a widget image immediately, that that information isn't, the latest log isn't on the widget image. Oh well. And, oh yeah, this is how I get the, um, the metric widget image. Um, this stuff isn't quite modeled yet, so I had to like write this by hand and I'm, yeah, I'm just using the past 72 hours. So I hope you found that useful. I think this is like a very, very easy way now to, to log interesting things and show little diagrams to people. So I'm pretty pleased about it. And, and it's a lot easier than setting up Grafana. So I hope you enjoy the video. Please give the video a like and um, subscribe if you like to see more of this stuff. Thanks again for watching and please comment below.